It's been a dangerous stretch of road for Northwest residents, so when a stoplight went up, many thought it would make things safer. But 23 ABC's Ivan Rodriguez says there's something literally just right around the corner that has drivers concerned tonight. Ivan? I'm standing right here at this streetlight at Mohawk and Hagman. Now, the people who I spoke with say ever since construction started in this area, they've seen quite a few accidents occur and many close calls. Driving through the stoplight at Hagman and Mohawk. Especially if you're not familiar with the area here, it can be really confusing. Caught some Northwest residents off guard. For months, the city has been preparing this intersection for the new light, citing safety reasons. A couple of close calls. But Ashland Dowling says if you're driving west on Hagman toward the light, these trees make it difficult to know there's a stoplight right around the corner. I was in traffic before driving behind another car, and they uh, just stopped. And unfortunately, it was about 5:30 during sunset, and the way that the sun set over it, it was really hard to see. They came to a dead stop, and I've got a truck barreling behind me at you know 45, 50 miles an hour. Ashlyn runs an at-home daycare center with her mom. There you go. And feels the new light has caused nothing but headaches. The street does curve around, and it kind of sits a little bit behind. The curvature of the street. Bakersfield police say there has been several crashes in the area during construction, and residents like Ashland say many people don't obey the 50 mile per hour speed limit. That combined with the light being hard to spot. I look and do the best that I can, but it is hard. Residents say that they hope this new light would help monitor traffic in this area, but not being able to see it as you're coming around doesn't really help. Live in Northwest Bakersfield, Ivan Rodriguez, 23 ABC.